Hello everyone and welcome back to Click Draw and welcome to a new Let's Play, Shardlight. This is a game by Wajidai Games, which is a company you're going to see a lot of stuff from <laughs> on my channel. Uh, I absolutely love Wajidai. They're, they're like my favorite uh, point and click adventure game company. Uh, but this was their new one that they just came out with, uh, not too long ago, and I've been really excited to play it. So, without further ado, also look at the pretty opening. So pr so pretty. I love, I love the pixel work in Watch It Eye games. Uh, and they only get better and better with each game, I love it. So let's begin. November 9th. The world ended 20 years ago today. What a strange, awful anniversary to celebrate. 20 years, and this city is still in ruins. 20 years, and the citizens are still dying on the streets. 20 years, and I'm no closer to fixing my mistake. As I look on the horizon today, I see many laborers going to their lottery jobs. They cling to hope that the ticket they earn will win them the vaccine they need to survive. Green Lung continues to take lives every day, but the people of this town are stubborn, resilient. They refuse to give up in the face of death. Dealing with the reactor won't take too long. Left click to interact, right click to examine. And the inventory is at the top here. Pretty typical for Rajai games. Uh, let's. It's my way back to the world above. Let's uh, take a look at some stuff. Why the hell would a cultist come down here? So there is a cult called the Ravens. And yes, I did play. I played this first part. Um. I played the part all the way up to the opening to sort of test it out, so I do know the puzzles in the first little bit. All right, so it's a really old lamp. There's a wax candle inside. I love how sugary sweet she sounds when <laughs> when she says that line. Not really in the mood to electrocute myself. There's a gas mask on it. Must be an extractor fan. We're gonna need this later. That leads further into the tunnel. It's some kind of control box with a plate on it. It's probably connected to the main power source in here. Oh. I'm starting to see why this was a lottery job. This better be worth it. Okay, that's my third time seeing that animation. I still really like it. I'm gonna try very hard. A heavy metal door. I'm gonna try very hard not to fangirl over every single bit of this game because, yeah, like I said, I'm a huge Wajidai fangirl. All right, so there is a piece of paper at the top of that wreckage there. So in order to get to it, we need to turn the speed of the fan up, and we need it. Need to hit it. Hit the exhaust button so that it moves out instead of in. Pull this pull cord. Oh, there's an old vent up there. It has a pull cord hanging from it. Looks like that used to be somebody's bathroom. Nice tile floor. Hmm. What's that thing up there? There's a piece of paper stuck up there. That was actually a really easy puzzle. I solved it by accident the first time. McTeague Maintenance Corp. There's a maintenance log underneath. The last inspection was 15 years ago. All right. So I believe that's everything we need to do up here for now. So let's head to the passage and do our job. Oh my god. Hello? Can you hear me? It took you long enough. I thought I was raven food. It's only been, uh, what, a 
Stay now. We need to get you out of here. Hey, 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 calm down, kid. I'm fine where I am. Who are you? They didn't tell you? I'm afraid not. <sighs> Typical. Aristocrats don't give a rat's ass about anyone else till their lights go out. I'm sorry. I don't quite follow. Did Tiberius send you to fix the reactor? Yes. Oh, I see. I'm your replacement, aren't I? It would seem so. Certainly hope you have better luck than I did. So what happened to you? Are you blind, kid? I came down here, I was about to get the reactor running, and there was a tremor. All hell breaks loose and now I'm crawling my way to the Reaper. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Don't be. Comes with the territory. But then, uh, you should know that, right? Is there anything you need? Anything I can help you with? Uh, I'm a dead man. Even if you went for help, I'd be gone by the time you got back. There's nothing at all? Can I do anything to make you more comfortable? You're nice, kid. But nice will get you killed. Just do your job. I'm not going anywhere. Don't move. I'll be back. Your sense of humor needs some work, kid. She's so nice. It's securely fastened to the wall. Feels like it has been for several years. She's so nice to everyone. I like her. There's a corpse. Click on the corpse. Oh, sorry. Like, she is so nice. <laughs> I relate to her a lot just because, like, she apologizes to everybody, including corpses. All right, so we got a bolt off of that. This will be useful once I find a weapon. Sorry, I skipped the part where we examine the corpse and see the bolt. Looks like another soldier. That corpse is just out of my reach. Corpses everywhere. He's got nothing else that can help me. Not exactly great swimming water or drinking water. So I actually, I don't actually know very much about this game. I know that it's a post-apocalyptic game and that we're trying to find a cure for our uncurable disease. That corpse is just out. My hand was all the way up here. How did it? Never mind. It's not budging. I don't know how to fix this on my own. Alright, let's go talk to the dude. Um, mister? Huh? I think this reactor needs a code, and I don't have it. Do you? You don't do this type of work often, do you? Not a reactor, no. I'm more experienced with cars, pumps, easy fixes. So a lottery worker, huh? Who's the vaccine for? Why do you care? Hang on. You look familiar. Do I know you? I'm a mechanic. I've got a shop just outside town. Maybe you came in. I knew a guy named uh, Cooper Weller once. I had a shop around there. Are you related? He was my dad. What's it matter to you? You're Cooper's girl. <laughs> so do you even care about Tiberius? I care about getting medicine. You said you wanted to help me, right? Yes. Do you need anything? I do. And if it works out, you'll never have to work a lottery job again. Excuse me? You heard me. But first, I need to know you're serious about helping. How am I supposed to trust you? This sounds really sketchy. How do I know I'll be safe? I can't make any promises, but you're Cooper's kid. Who's Cooper? I can trust anyone to help me. It's you. All right, I'll help you. Is that a promise? Yes. Thank you. Before my accident, I figured out that this reactor just needs a hard reset. To do that, you'll need to input the reset code, which is the unit's serial number. Just find the compliance plate and you'll be good to go. By the way, how's your shooting? Could be worse, could be better. Then take this. A crossbow? <sighs> it's not like I need it anymore. I picked it up off that corpse over there. It hasn't got any bolts, but... I see you already got one from that other body. Thanks. I'll see about getting that reactor started. Okay, so we now have a crossbow. It's the crossbow the reactor tech gave me. I've got one bolt. And if we left click on it, 
I can't just go. Yeah, I'm not gonna go shoot around random stuff, but we got a little target thing there. Okay, this part actually. Ugh, this part actually confused the heck out of me. And I'll show you why in a second. First, let's get back to this it's thing. It's some kind of control box. It's too corroded to read. Alright, so it's too corroded to read, so now we go back to the dude. And we need to ask him about it. Um, mister? Huh? Found the compliance plate. I found the compliance plate. plate, but it's too corroded to read. Oh, sure. I ran into my fair share of those. Good thing about those plates is the numbers are always embossed. I had this trick where you put some paper over the plate and you rub it with a pencil so you can make out the numbers. I don't know where you'll be able to find one of those down here, but you might be able to uh, improvise something else. Don't move. I'll be back. I'm not exactly going anywhere. Alright, so here's the part that really confused me, because I could not figure out what the heck we needed, because we have the paper. So now we need some kind of pencil or some kind of material to rub on it, and... I basically started click on everything with the paper, trying to figure out if there was some dirt or something we could put on it. Forgot about this thing. It's a really old lamp. There's a wax candle inside. So we take the crossbow, we shoot the lamp. The lamp didn't survive the fall. But the wax candle, the candle did. might be useful. I'll take my bolt too. All right, so we got our bolt back, and we got a wax candle. So now we can go to the box. We can put on the plate. I'd, sorry, on the put the paper on the plate, and now we can use the wax candle. Woo! Unit serial number, and it is two. S How dark can I make this? Two seven nine four. Okay. Exit, and now we head back to the reactor. Do 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 do. Fixing reactors. Do 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 do. All right. And it was two seven nine. Four? Yeah. There we go. There we go. That wasn't too hard. That is Good a job. terrifying. Get over here. That is a terrifying reactor. That was faster than I expected. Maybe there's still time to. Your optimism's cute, but I'm not going anywhere. Listen up, okay? This is how you can help me. Take this letter. It's going to Danton, in the Market District. You should be able to find the right place if you ask around. Danton? Who's that? I don't know anyone named Danton in the Market District. You'll figure it out. Look, it's very important to me, and to you, that you deliver this letter. I... I understand. I'll take care of it. Great. Now for the second part of the deal. I need you to shoot me. In the head. Clean as you can. N no I, I can't. I'm in a lot of pain, kid. Let me die with some dignity. There's no way I'd get fixed up in time. We both know it. I want to go out on my own terms. I don't know if I can. Buck up, kid. It's a hard world, and in order to survive, you gotta do lots of things you don't like. Reaper be damned! Don't go out my own way! Please, let's just get this over with. In case you were wondering, this really hurts. Alright, so I'm actually curious if... This is a morality choice here where we could leave if we wanted to, but I'm gonna help this guy out. Thanks, dude. Rest in peace. Last chance. Are you sure about this? Completely. You can do it. <sighs> One last thing. Y yes? What was your name again? It's been so long since I heard Cooper talk about you. It's Amy. What's yours? 
not important. Everyone's it's name is important. Thank you, pardon. You asked before about my taking this job, who the vaccine was for. It's for me. I started feeling the symptoms about a week ago, and, well, I'm desperate. Ah, oh, shit. I'm so sorry. What's happening to you? What happened to your old man? Uh, it's not fair. You can make it right, Amy. Just deliver the letter, and everything will change. You'll see. Thank you. I wish you nothing but the best. And that is the beginning of Shard Light. Now everything on to this point is completely blind. So I will see you guys in the next episode. I know, Amy. I know. This has really gone and thrown a wrench in the works. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!